Hi, this is Savitri. I want to show you a few fun things that you can do with your brush or even your pencil tool. So here's my work area and I'll just pick a brush and up here you can, you know, change your diameter, hardness and whatnot. But if you click on your little brush tool, you have a little bit more option. So let me just, you know, remove all this stuff and let's just click on a regular brush and you can change the you know pick a preset diameter here or you can move this around type it in manually do whatever you need to do there and then you can go into the brush tip shape and you can you know do more with the diameter here you can change the angle the roundness and how hard or soft your brush line is and here's the fun thing that you can do you can add some spacing let me pick a bigger size so you can see it better you see the little dots and in my example from earlier you can see a little dotted um, rounded rectangle over here so I'll just select this now well, let me just make it a little smaller and put that back and let me just make some help lines here so I know what the heck I'll be doing and where there we go just a little bit more there So now I can go here and pushing my shift so that I'll create a straight line. I can create, oops, I always create a new layer. That way you're not drawing on top of one another on one layer. It's easier to edit this way. Let's remove the guide and see how I've made little lines and now I can print this and do a hybrid and start writing my um, journaling here or use it for a digital image and you can create your own little uh, note tag. Let's see, let's remove this and have that. Next thing you can do is you can also do this with the pencil tool. And again, let's just go over here. You can pick your size, your spacing. Let's make it a little bigger. Let's change the spacing here a little bit. And I want to have, let's do the dual brush, make it a little thicker. And again, you can just have fun with this and you know experiment and see what comes out of it let's just do that and just start writing you can make little butterfly paths that's what I like to do or just be a little artistic and make little make little flowers there you go Alright, that might not be a most attractive flower, but you get the picture. You can go back in here and just, you know, change it to a small one. Move the spacing a little bit. Move it away. You can make more. Alrighty. That's what you can do and, you know, there's so many buttons you can push there, so just experiment with them and see what kind of brush shape you can come up with. Thanks for watching.